Well, in a certain sense, my uh, best instinct is to uh, stand at the front of the room and uh, to tell you everything that I know about the uh, success. project that we recently uh, celebrated at uh, Lac, uh, with Lac Sewell First Nation. You cannot imagine just how powerful an experience it was for children of that First Nation's community to have the chance to attend at the official opening of a, 12, of a very, very beautiful 12 and a, 12 and a half megawatt uh, generating station where they're actually uh, taught to understand that they own part of it. And I really uh, do feel that uh, that's going to go down as one of the more extraordinary experiences that I may ever have. Only thing is, it motivates me to uh, seek for further opportunities to replicate that across the breadth of the province of Ontario. Uh, the Green Energy Act is, uh, is, a, um, is a platform uh, for uh, taking Ontario's ambitions one or two notches higher in terms of bringing more green energy project to life in the province of Ontario. But substantially, we've already started to implement the approach that the bill underscores. As an example, feed-in tariffs and the hard work and proposals that Ontario Power Authority has de developed didn't have to wait for the passage of a bill. So we've been working on a parallel track basis to try and make sure that we bring this to life. It's a pretty big body of work for anyone that's taken a good hard look at the contents of the bill. It isn't just about renewables, it's also about the things that we can do here in Ontario to be even kinder to the environment, which is to use less electricity and less energy, of creating some enhanced financial tools that will make more uh, likely the prospects of this principle of direct ownership in projects by First Nations. We are going to make uh, some early moves on uh, enhancement of transmission capacity in the Northwest with the long-needed construction of a line uh, that will go from uh, Pickle Lake to Nipigon. Uh, I, I, I don't have a map in uh, I don't have a map in front of me, but I got a part of one in my mind, and I know that that project achieves a bunch of things simultaneously. It brings some additional renewable uh, projects into play. Uh, it uh, provides uh, much needed uh, electricity generation for Muscle White Mine, uh, which has been a very very successful mine, and where First Nations are uh, quite uh, quite involved in it. And it begins to offer the tantalizing prospect of taking some communities off diesel. The First Nations are in a very, very powerful spot. And uh, we, should, uh, we should make sure uh, that, uh, that that is uh, appropriately uh, recognized over the course of the next number of years.